Welcome back to Sissy Maya. Here, we embrace true femininity. Make sure to subscribe to our channel to never miss an update. It was a typical Friday night in the bustling city of New York. The neon lights of Times Square were illuminating the streets, and the sounds of people partying and chatting filled the air. The VIP club, known for its extravagant ambience and exclusive clientele, was the place to be for anyone looking for a night of luxury and fun. However, for one group of friends, this night would be unlike any other they had experienced before, as it was going to be their first cross-dressing night out at the VIP club. Samantha, Claire, and Lily had been friends since college. They were all successful career women in their mid-twenties, but deep down, they all had a secret desire to step out of their comfort zones and embrace their inner femininity. They had always talked about going out together dressed up as women, but the fear of being judged and ridiculed by others always held them back. However, after months of convincing and pep talks, they finally decided to make their dream a reality and that too at the VIP club. The girls spent weeks planning their outfits, hair, and makeup, determined to look as elegant and glamorous as possible. They carefully chose their dresses, shoes, and accessories, making sure everything was perfect. Samantha, who was the tallest and most athletic in the group, chose a figure-hugging black sequin dress that accentuated her curves. She paired it with stilettos and diamond earrings, giving her an air of sophistication. Claire, who was petite and had a bubbly personality, opted for a baby pink ruffled dress, complementing her fair complexion. Lily, who was the shy and reserved one, decided to go for a floor-length red dress with a plunging neckline, making her look like a powerful and confident woman. As the clock struck 9 p.m., the girls were ready to hit the town. The three of them were nervous and excited at the same time, not knowing what the night had in store for them. They hailed a cab and arrived at the VIP club, walking towards the entrance with butterflies in their stomachs. As they approached the bouncers, they realized that their efforts had paid off as they were greeted with compliments and whistles. The bouncers, who were used to seeing the rich and famous, were intrigued by the girls' unique dressing style and welcomed them with open arms. They ushered them inside, and as the girls entered the club, their jaws dropped in amazement. The VIP club was like something out of a movie. The walls were adorned with vibrant artworks, and the floors were made of marble, giving the place a luxurious feel. The music was loud, and the dance floor was packed with people moving and grooving to the beats. The girls spotted a bar at the other end of the room and decided to make their way there. As they walked, they couldn't help but feel empowered and confident. All eyes were on them, but instead of feeling self-conscious, they felt liberated. They were no longer afraid of being judged by others, instead, they embraced their femininity with pride. At the bar, they were offered a selection of drinks by the bartender. Feeling adventurous, they decided to try out some cocktails they had never heard of before. The drinks were delicious, and the girls couldn't resist having a few more. As they sipped their drinks, they observed the people around them. The VIP club had a diverse crowd, with people from all walks of life, each with their unique style and persona. The girls were amazed to see how accepting and open-minded everyone was, and it made them feel more comfortable in their own skin. Feeling bold and confident, Samantha suggested they hit the dance floor. They made their way through the crowd and joined in the fun. As they danced, all their worries and inhibitions melted away, and they were just three friends having the time of their lives. As the night went on, the girls were approached by several people, all intrigued by their cross-dressing night out. It was refreshing to see how people were not only accepting of their unconventional appearance but also eager to strike up a conversation and know more about them. One particularly handsome man caught Lily's attention. He was dressed impeccably in a three-piece suit, and he had an air of mystery and charm around him. He approached Lily and struck up a conversation, and the sparks flew between them instantly. After a night of dancing, laughing, and making new friends, the girls realized it was getting late, 
and it was time to head back home. As they walked out of the VIP club, they couldn't help but feel grateful for this experience. It had been a night of liberation, empowerment, and most importantly, acceptance of who they truly were. The next morning, the girls met for brunch, and as they reminisced about their cross-dressing night out, they couldn't help but smile with satisfaction. They had conquered their fears and insecurities and had a fantastic time doing so. Eating.